welcome welcome to my channel i am your english uh, english language teacher or english concord expert but today i have something extremely important okay for my viewers all over the world it is titled five smart ways okay to improve your speaking english how do you improve your spoken english or how do you improve your speaking skills there are several i have five ideas here that will help you to improve your speaking skills your communicative skill do not forget that in the 21st century in the rapidly emerging digital uh, kind of uh, economy of the 21st century that our communication proficiency matters a lot english language is the lingua franca of the world it is language of, of business it is language of the internet it is language of education so it is important that everyone okay who wants to uh, succeed okay puts into consideration the mastery the proficiency okay in uh, this uh, uh, subject or in this language so what are the five smart ways to improve your speaking skills i have done my research i've listened to experts in the field i've read several books look at them several books several several books several books several books okay on this subject it is based on my personal experience okay i lecture english language okay i have uh, youtube videos i train teachers i train uh, students so what are the five okay smart ways to improve your speaking skills the first one is this you have to commit to listening the more you listen to, to okay uh, to the speakers okay of this language okay the more proficient you become do not forget god almighty has given us two ears so that we can listen more and talk less so always you can listen to news Okay, BBC, for, for example, okay, turning to, to BBC News, maybe on radio or on your cable kind of uh, 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 television and listen to them. Listen to music, okay, listen to watch movies, especially those that are uh, uh, movies produced by British, okay, uh, directors, okay, uh, Canadian directors, okay, the, the, um, the American, okay, directors. As you do this, you discover that your proficiency is going to really improve. Then the other one has to do with that you have to automate your vocabulary. What, what do I mean by automate your vocabulary? Okay, how does one, how does a kind of a thing become automatic? It is by consistent practice. It is by repetition. Okay, it is by elaboration. It is by imagination. If you learn a new word, for example, like, let's say you you actually uh, you you learn that hook, line, and sinker. Okay, means uh, that absolute uh, absolute belief in something uh, for example okay i believe that that uh, china is going to to emerge as uh, the world's okay superpower a nation i believe this hook line and sinker it means that i believe it absolutely without any reservation so what you what you need to do that whenever you come across maybe a new vocabulary or a, a new phrase or a new expression make sure that you keep okay uh, practice, practicing it until it becomes automatic until it becomes okay natural then the, the third uh, idea has to do with focus on chunks what do i mean by focus on chunks make sure that if you look at a sentence okay you, you are to do what to break the sentence okay bit by bit for example if the uh, if you uh, for example look look at this word okay uh, either the cat or the dogs okay are in the kitchen so all you need to do is that you do what you break this either the cat you read it intently then after that you read this okay uh, the dogs okay are in the kitchen. okay how wh why why uh, the dogs are why not the dogs okay is it is because of what this s okay the uh, the noun here is a has okay, is a plural now so it must go with what with a, a plural verb so you must try to do what to break words okay into uh, chunks and before you know it your proficiency would have uh, really uh increased your learning curve will rapidly increase then the fourth point is that push yourself before your comfort zone please don't be ashamed to make mistakes don't be ashamed to ask questions okay make sure that you go out and listen to the to, to speakers okay of uh, this language and before you know it just because of your commitment your dedication your nervous system will definitely respond 
and that is one of the basis or the core of factors okay underlying okay, learning and memory do not learn keep practicing go beyond your comfort comfort zone and stretch yourself that the the the, the, the fifth uh, skill has to do with do not forget whatever you learn keep practicing it a practice makes a progress not practice makes a perfect no one is perfect okay the more you practice especially you practice daily what i call daily atomic okay learning dal d a r okay when you do do that okay as you do that your body okay your brain especially your prefrontal cortex those neurons those concept neurons they will help you okay to improve and before you know in your english language neural circuit will start expanding then this the, the i think one of the bonuses has to do with Yes, dictionaries. Okay, get a dictionary. Okay, buy books. Okay, writ written by a uh, English uh, uh, by British. Okay, uh, authors and authoresses. Watch their movies. Okay, make sure that you you commit yourself to learning. Okay, new words. Okay, in your dictionary almost on a daily daily basis. This is my dictionary. As you do all this, you discover that okay, okay, before you you know it. Your proficiency, okay, in English language would have done what would have increased. So thank you so much for your time. Thank you for listening to me. Please uh, drop a comment if you have any questions. Subscribe to my channel. I am committed, okay, uh, to helping students and individuals all over the world. And I shall see you in the next video.